Turkish time. Today's dish is jajak. You may know it as sasiki. There are, there's a slight difference between sasiki and jajak, and it's all in the thickness of the yogurt. Jajak is a great accompaniment to köfte or kebabs, um, or it can be used as a dip to dip your Turkish bread into. Let's have a look at the ingredients for jajak. The first ingredient is yogurt. Yogurt is actually a Turkish word that has spread throughout um, the whole world. The other thing is grated uh, Lebanese cucumber. You can use other variations of cucumber, but you may find that they're a bit seedy. Ensure when you're um, putting the cucumber into the yogurt to make sure that you have got all the water and juice out of it so it's quite dry, otherwise it'll make the judge quite soggy. Garlic. Salt and smoked paprika, of which we'll use as a garnish. Mint, continental parsley, of which we'll add to the garnish. First, what we're going to do is chiffonade um, the mint. So let's just grab some mint and roll it like you would roll a bunch of paper. Garlic. Now we're going to put all the ingredients together so that we've got a refreshing judget to have next to our köfte or um, to Okay, first thing we need is yogurt. Probably um, for a family of four, we probably need about three big scoops. that we've actually squeezed all the juice out of. It's been grated. Um, Lebanese cucumber is preferable and um, I've only used half of Lebanese cucumber for the three or four scoops of yogurt. Okay. The garlic. A bit of salt and the chopped up mint. mix it all around. Now most um, recipes that you'll find for jajuk and also salsiki do add olive oil. Um, I prefer not to because I do prefer a healthier version. Sprinkling. Just garnish it with some if you choose to put some olive oil over the top, um, you're quite welcome to. So that is salsiki or jajak as it's known in Turkish cuisine.